Hello wonderful people. Welcome to the brand new episode of The Art of Public Speaking. Today I am going to read talk about New Year's Day message. Although we wish each other a happy new year, yet there must on this day come to each of us the thought that another year has ended. with all its joys and sorrows its triumphs and its disappointments what will the new year bring will it bring success of our plans the fulfillment of our dreams or will it bring session of pain and worry peace of the storm we are standing at the threshold of a new year this announcement of time when the two years meet can bring for some element of sorrow sorrow for the failures of the past but it has an element of joy for more of us as it is a moment of hope that opens new possibilities and opportunities it is therefore also a moment of resolve on this day we should make a balance sheet of our acts of omissions and commissions and strike a balance most of us would stand on the debit side but i believe that very few of us would say today i will strive harder i will do better i will accomplish more in this year that's just commencing It is true that resolutions foolishly or unwisely made and speedily broken often result in more harm than good because they tend to weaken the morale but a genuine effort to better one's condition must prove beneficial to the individual in particular and to the society in general there is no question but that the world would be a better place in which to live if we would all carry our resolutions not to do certain things the greatest trouble seems to be in finding the particular things that we can give up most of us are so good that we have no besetting sin but this afternoon evening tonight we must not moralize it is the timing for rejoicing the old year is ended the bright new year which with all its possibilities for success and happiness is before us i do know one thing for certain how i venture into the new year depends on me the high attitude is gratitude to god and goodwill to follow beings to fellow beings i learn from the past i grasp the present i launch into the future i thank god for what i am and i thank him for bringing me to this day and to this hour what happens around me is important but what happens in me is more important let us in the beautiful lines of el michel thorn pay tributes to the bells which heard its coming and youth is eagerly waiting and the age is glad to hear the ringing bells the singing bells the bells of the new year so a happy new year to all of us thank you